What's going on everybody? It's your boy Donnie. We back. I know it's been a long time since I made a video. But I had to sort some things out, you know, um kind of figure out where my channel is going, what direction we're going. And I am back. I'm back for good. We're making videos. Everything is going exactly the way I want to. I have videos lined up now. Um I have ideas on the way. So now all we got to do is put out the content, man. the content is coming, I know I've been getting people messaging me, asking me what the hell is going on with the YouTube channel, because you started out doing some good 2K videos and then you just stopped, but uh, hey, we're back, we're back to stay for good, and let's get into it, man, today I have a season mode video of my beautiful Manchester United team, you know, we're about three seasons in, so the team looks a lot different than from what it used to be in the beginning of FIFA 17. Uh, we got Pogba, Sterling, Griezmann, Royce. Am I forgetting people? Coleman is on the bench. Uh, am I forgetting somebody? Uh, and there are transfers. There are some transfers coming in before I forget. I almost forgot that there are more players on the way. Uh, even though this has been uh, pre-recorded, this was probably like from a couple days ago. I have just never had a chance to do some of the commentaries that I want to do for my channel. So expect a lot more content coming your way in the next couple of days. So yeah, that was the first announcement. Second announcement that I have is about specifically what type of content I'm trying to bring in the next couple of weeks. Um, I have obviously FIFA. FIFA is going to be the main thing. I have that lined up. Manchester United have I will also have some 2K. I, I have some 2K park videos that I want to bring to you guys. There were a couple of good games with me and my boy Thomas. Shout out to Thomas. Um, we we got a we got a couple of games uh, running up in the park. Uh, maybe like two weeks ago, almost. Yeah. Even though the dates of the gameplays itself are kind of far apart. You know, quality, quality over, you know, quantity, so you'll be seeing that as well. Um, yeah, man, we got a lot of exciting stuff happening, but, you know, you got to make the time to actually record the videos and edit the videos, and sometimes, you know, you can lose, how can I say, you can, you can lose motivation to, to actually do these uploads and recordings because it does take a long time it does take a lot of effort for you to actually put out something that you like to do and that you like to rewatch because the, the hardest part about um editing videos is rewatching the same clips over and over and over and over so you get dizzy and crazy but you know i just recently found some new motivation and i know exactly now what i want to do for my channel and i think i can be up there with the very best if you give me some time um, you can just look at some of my other videos if you haven't had a chance. Just check it out if you're interested. Hit that subscribe. If not, just watch this on your break or something like that. And just keep moving, you know. Just good vibes only on my channel. But yeah. I also, um, since this is a Manchester United season mode. And I'm a Manchester United fan. I'm a big Manchester United fan. Actually, I've been a Manchester United fan since about uh, 2005. That's when people were still doubting that Cristiano Ronaldo was the best in the world, but I think he settled that by now. But anyway, I also wanted to get into Manchester United team news. So there will be videos where I will go into like transfers. For example, Morata looks like he's going to be joining us for like 60 mil. You know, like stuff like that. Like anytime you have like transfer or Manchester United team news, I, I want to bring that to you guys as well. That's something new that I've been thinking about. Um, also, for FIFA 18, which is coming out soon, by the way, it's coming out in about September. Is it used to come out way later than that, but I guess uh, they they changed that a few years back. That it, it now comes out in September. Uh, the the demo that if the demo drops, I I do believe there's a demo drop in for FIFA 18. I will be reviewing that. I will be playing that extensively and reviewing that for all you guys so that you guys kind of have a, a feel of what to expect um, from the gameplay that i have seen so far of fifa 18 
Uh, the gameplay actually looks very fast. Uh, doesn't look that comfortable, but you don't know until you play it. Uh, looks is especially with FIFA, looks is one thing because you know it, it always looks good, lighting's good, and stuff like that. The field looks good, but the feel for the game you don't get until you actually play it because not everybody knows how to play. Uh, sometimes you'll get these guys that go to these expos and E3 and all that, and they have never touched a, a FIFA game or any other game for that matter in their life. It's the most frustrating thing in the world because. For us, the, the gamers that really play the game, it's hard for us to judge how good the game is until we get our hands on it. So, I'll definitely be bringing you the demo review and the full review when the game drops. Definitely, definitely, definitely look out for that. That's going to be a really big video. Um, it's an important video for me because it will be the first FIFA that I have ever reviewed, probably since FIFA 09. And that used to be my old YouTube channel, which I don't have anymore. Uh, didn't really know much about copyrights back in the day, so yeah, you know, you know what happened with that channel. But definitely look out for that video, uh, FIFA FIFA 18 review. That's that's a big review coming up. And other than that, there's 2K also that, like I said previously, that I'm gonna be bringing to you guys. And anything else for that matter that you guys are interested in or you wanna have a session where you wanna play with me, and I'll, I'll just live stream it. We just you know we just hang out, we chill, we play. Stuff like that. Exciting things are coming to the channel. Just know, just know that this will be a new channel that you gotta look out for it. on at least every other day type of basis. I'm trying to upload maybe at least tw at least twice a week. I'm trying to upload a video, so it can be FIFA, FIFA, or it can be FIFA 2K, or it can be even Battlefield. I have Battlefield One. I have I have Infinite Warfare and Remastered. But I prefer not to play those games because, you know, it gets boring. Yeah. There's, there are millions, literally, there are millions of people that are currently playing and reviewing and broadcasting Call of Duty. And I, I feel like it's so outdated. Uh, the reason I decided to get back on the season mode type of um, vibe is I feel like a lot of people that play this game, they don't really play it right, you know? Videos are boring. The videos don't lack. They lack excitement. So that's what I'm definitely gonna bring to you guys. Uh, just by watching my my gameplay now, like you, you can tell, like all jokes aside, like, you know, the, the team that I put together is very fluid. Uh, I, it's well thought out. There's a reason why most of these players are even on the team, and why some have been sold by now. For example, everybody. He's a great player in real life, but I sold him. I sold him to Arsenal for like 60 million. For some reason, I countered, I counter offered Arsenal, got back the 60 million. Once I got back the 60 million, I used that plus more to buy Griezmann. When I bought Griezmann, I was able to buy Royce, and then from there, my whole team started building over like three seasons. So I know like we're like a long time in, but at the same time, that's good because imagine if I had made, I think Rashford's about to score here, he does. If I had made that that season of videos from the beginning of FIFA 17 to now, you guys would be bored by it. So me doing it now kind of gives me a, a chance to just lay out my team and what has happened over the years. Just in time for FIFA 18 to come out so we can jump on to the new game. Um, speaking of Rashford, uh, Rashford is actually at 82 in my season mode, and he's a beast for some reason. For some reason, he can do everything. He can shoot. Um, his growth is, is is very high, obviously for his age. His growth is very high. His finishing is ridiculous. He's quick. Um, good movement off the ball. So all these little things, you know, make your team better once you realize what type of player you have in your team and how you want to line that up. I bought Benteke as a backup just in case. Uh, he's at 83 now, uh, but he brings more height. So whenever I have a tough game where I just need somebody to get some headers in, I put Benteke in the game for them. But yeah, other than that, you guys let me know how the channel is going. So. I like to make videos based on what you guys are saying. So if you guys are telling me, Don, these videos are great. Keep making them. I'll do that. I'll definitely do that. I, I got a lot of I got a lot of positive feedback on my early 2K videos. So I will definitely bring that. But I've never really brought uh, the season mode videos for FIFA. So you guys definitely let me know how that's going. Give me feedback. Tell me what I need to improve on. Am I speaking too soft? 
Uh, do I gotta adjust the mic? I'm using the PlayStation mic, honestly. So all these things over the next couple months, we're gonna improve and we're gonna learn them and we're gonna grow. Like we're really gonna have a, a nice way for us to to build this channel. And this channel is gonna be made by you guys, not even me. Because if it's not for you guys, then I, I would have nobody to watch the videos. So definitely, feedback is appreciated. But just keep it clean, you know. I don't need to hear no negativity. Definitely no, no, no derogatory comments or slurs or anything like that. You will be you will be blocked and banned immediately. I don't play around with stuff like that. I don't got time for that. You know, we got all types of kids watching these videos. I don't need no negativity. Pogba, Pogba, he's in. Boba scores. 2-0, it's easy, remember this is world class difficulty by the way, I'm not bringing you over with quality content and then lie to you on professional difficulty, some of that's just ridiculous, I've seen that before in the past, uh, you know, you gotta act, put difficulty at least to, on world class, uh, it doesn't have to be higher than that because after world class it gets unrealistic, that's why I never really bother with legendary, but world class is fine. It's just about balance. Even sometimes a world class, it doesn't seem fair what the computer is doing, but I can deal with that. But yeah, we're almost, we're only like a couple minutes away from the end of the video. I'm not ending the video yet, but I'm just letting you guys know so you guys have an idea. What you're in for. Um, it's definitely uh, an exciting time. It's an exciting time for the channel because I think. This will be a very, very popular FIFA channel in about a year or so. So from now until next summer, around this time, we're going to see the growth. I'm aiming by that time. I want to have at least um, at least 2,000 subscribers. I would like it to have at least 2,000 subscribers by, by next year. You know, depending on maybe even more, but I think a good limit right now would be 2,000. A good goal for us to grow is 2,000 subscribers by next year, and anything that comes after that is a is is, is a blessing, and I'll take it. I mainly make these videos for fun. I'm not really in it for the compensation, or whatever, to be a big broadcaster or YouTuber. You know, I don't really care. I always love playing FIFA, but I just never actually put the time aside to make the fit the 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 videos to showcase my skills and, and what I can do so that's definitely what we're going to be working on when we, when we make these videos it's a good place to win Manchester the United is, is heavily involved in everything that we do um, just quickly sure. back to FIFA 18 um, I might I don't know if I mentioned this before but I'll say it again um, I don't like the journey the journey to me it was repetitive and the AI was terrible so if if the journey becomes something that people want to see, I will play it. But it's not on my list of things to play at this moment in time. Once I review FIFA 18, there might be I might have a different opinion on it based on what it is. But from what it was in FIFA 17, it was not worth playing for me after after a while. After a while, you played it and it just felt like you were wasting your time, you know, trying to play the game because the AI was terrible. It's, it's almost like they made the AI terrible on purpose for for the actual game mode to become more realistic, which is ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we're coming towards the end here. We're in the 90th minute. Can we get another goal? It looks like we're getting another goal. There's Benteke. There's Benteke. That's why you put him in the game. You know, he adds some height. It's 3-0. It's, it's an easy goal for us. You know, this Manchester United team is absolutely ridiculous. That I, it's probably my best team that I've ever put together in FIFA. So definitely, definitely, definitely excited about that. I'm definitely excited about what I was able to do for the three seasons that I played. Um, I'm looking forward to showcasing that with you guys. And just, you know, help the channel grow. If you want to see more, leave a like, comment, positive. It's preferred, you know. Because we can only go up from here. And it's your boy Don again. I'm, I'm going to just let the video play out so that you guys can hear the stats. Um, I hope y'all have a good rest of your day. More content coming soon. And that's it, man. I'm out. Peace.